13 from a new business venture in Trotwood to new Dayton police officers. Here are the five things you need to know for this day ahead. A rape suspect is scheduled in court today. Montgomery County deputies say 19 year old Blake Cole raped a child at the Fort McKinley United Methodist Church. He was arrested there Tuesday night. A deputy was working security and says he caught Cole with the child. Dan Edwards will have a live update coming up in the next half hour and two news will let you know what happens today in court beginning tonight at five. A Dayton Police Department, the Dayton Police Department will grow by 20 officers today. A ceremony will be held at Sinclair Community College to swear in 20 new graduates. This is a video of a similar ceremony from last August. It begins at 6 p.m. in Smith Auditorium at Sinclair. Retired Dayton Police Chief Jim Newby will be the keynote speaker. This is Dayton's 101st police recruit class. A hip hop concert to celebrate coming together as a community. It's all part of the Speak, Be Heard, be considered discussion forums. It started last night with this gathering at Omega Baptist Church between the community and police. But tonight there will be a concert featuring hip hop pioneer MC Light at Thurgood Marshall High School in Dayton. A new venture will help provide clothing to those in need in Trotwood. New Path Inc. will open Isaiah's Threads in the 400 block of East Main Street. It will offer quality new and nearly new clothing at reasonable, price, reasonable prices and fairly traded international items. A ribbon cutting is set for noon. Just last year, this organization, along with Ginghamsburg Church, opened the Point Ministry at a storefront just down the street from here. You can watch for a complete report tonight on 2 News at 5. The Dayton Dragons will take to the field tonight after rain washed out last night's game. The home opener was scheduled for yesterday at 7:10, but as our meteorologist predicted, Mother Nature had other ideas. So home opening activities will take place at tonight's game. Thursday's game will now be Saturday. Now, of course, Jack Pohl and Hutch Connerman will bring you all the fanfare and the highlights tonight at 10 and 11. You can always find more information on these or any of today's top stories online at WDTN.com.